Morning, afternoon, it's 153. What a beautiful day. It's 78 degrees outside. Oh. They are definitely working over here. Not too sure what that's going to be, but there's in relation for anybody that knows Kent. It's right there. And it's yeah, making progress on it. Not even class today, just a review for next Wednesday's final. So that will be fairly simple. Uh oh. Uh oh, we got the fuzz over there. It's no bueno. We got a Mustang. GT. We're done. Done with that. Just a review, about 35 minutes, about what's going to be on the exam. 40 questions, 40 points, 40% 40 of the final grade. So we'll get that out of the way next Tuesday at 12.45 to 3 o'clock. I'll be out of there by 1.30. The midterm was pretty simple. I think I got a... 38 out of 40 on that, so I'll aim for that or better. Um, cloudless blue. I can get used to this. It's 84 degrees right now. Uh, it actually doesn't feel as hot as yesterday. It must be something with the humidity. But I'm going to go home. I've got three yards that need to be mowed. Mine is the worst. Uh, I don't know which one's going to get done today. And then I'll probably pull some more leaves and maybe get out into town tonight. It's just gorgeous, gorgeous weather. Um, next week goes downhill a little bit. There's a little bit of rain in the 60s maybe. But uh, it's fine. It's May. Happy May, May 1st. Uh, we're here, guys. Winter is finally over. It's May. And I can call it. So, cool. We hope 3.25 p.m. And I got, oh, I was looking at the three yards. They're all going to be pretty bad. I don't know if any of them are still wet. It hasn't rained in a few days. It's been very sunny, so that should help. But as you know, yesterday I did that one. Slid the mower back there. That was good times. But mine is horrendous. Look at this right here. It's going to be a big mess, my, the whole thing. It's, it's going to be like seven dumps on my little catcher thing. But now that you can see in the light, Landscaping's come along pretty well. Probably work on that after I mow. Really, mine needs it the most, but um, it's a different kind of paying customer story. They pay up front for the whole month, and, and that means three digits. So I think I'll go over there today and do that, and that pushes that to tomorrow, and then that means mine's Friday. Three more days. It's going to be horrible. Look at that. Oh, it's pretty. I like that kind. So, yeah, so yesterday I started here. Hold on, let me get rid of my headphones. I started here, and I worked over this way. Cleaning these out, I'm getting every single leaf out of here. I'm doing a very good job, so that's all clear. I did here and back behind that where the house is, and that's creepy. And then I did these first two boxwood bushes. Here's what I haven't done. It's not as bad from the, from the front, but come around to the back. You see just what a complete mess that is. Look at that. That's all leaves. In comparison, over here is not. There's the dividing line. So maybe tonight, if I have the energy and my back isn't killing me yet, I'll bring it over and finish it to the sidewalk, which then means I only have this side of it, which isn't nearly as bad, and I may be able to do that in one sitting because there aren't just bags, bagfuls of leaves just sitting there. Oh my god, 6.09 p.m. Both of them are now done. I am beat. I just took about a 48 second shower, showered and shaved everything like I usually do in a very short amount of time. So that makes three yards in the past two days and I've got one more to go. I'm going to dinner now to meet the grandparents and I'm going to be late so I gotta get there but we still have perfectly blue 100% cloud-free blue skies, and it's 79 out right now. That's too bad. Damn. That's an Audi R8. Okay, dinner is over. Check it out. We got ourselves a Maserati. Well, boys, flames add power. Everybody knows that. Good guy. Bye, right, How's it going? And there's that A8, looking good. And the bike taking up the whole spot. Oh, beautiful parking there at the Audi. He's got a radar detector. He's got a radar detector. I respect that. 
Well guys, welcome to Hudson. We found the R8, it's lurking around downtown. I'll get out of your shot. Next to a fellow Volkswagen, uh, A4, 6, 4, 5, not a 5, I don't know. It's backed in, it's the V10 too, which means he's got plenty of horses. And I believe it's a six speed, look at that. Not bad. It's on Friday. Oh, it's a Can-Am. I don't know what BRP stands for on it. Burpee. Right. I don't like that. He's got the antennas on to make it look faster. Antennae. Antennae, yeah. Would cool. you buy one? No. No, I need I. We also found a Ducati. I don't know very much at all about Ducatis, but that's a nice bike. Well, guys, look at that parking. This is a black hey, Chevy Impala. Yeah, Brad. Are you kidding me? You can put an entire smart car behind that. That sounds, it is, that's an E63. Oh, I heard that. That sounds good. Welcome back home, it's two o'clock in the morning. Uh, I have been a busy bee for the last three and a half hours. Totally just rebuilt my iPhone. Uh, restored the factory settings, reinstalled the OS, reinstalled all the apps, everything to hopefully yield better battery life. Um, I've been going through about three full charges a day. When I first got it, it would be one. Usually one was just about, it would be pretty dead by the end of the day, but I could do it on, on a full day on a charge. And I've been doing three times that with the same usage or less. So yeah, just did that on the phone with Colt. He did the same thing. Anyways, got home from seeing lots of nice cars and having a good dinner downtown. It was dark when I got home, but I did go out and work on the landscaping for a little bit. I got two more of those five bushes done, so I almost got to the front door. Not quite. Uh, that'll be tomorrow. Uh, I only have literally a, a quarter of a bag left, but I couldn't have done it tonight. I would have had to bring a light out there to do it right, and I'm not doing that. So I don't get done tomorrow, but I'm going to wrap this up now. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow, Thursday, the last day of classes for my freshman year of college. Um, three exams next week. They'll be fairly short. I already told you this one's going to be fairly easy. We'll get those other two out of the way and we're done. Alright, thanks for watching and we'll talk to you guys on Thursday.